So like my every day is, I always start like with a journal. I never check emails, go on the laptop before realistically probably 11, 12, 11 a.m., 12 p.m. The morning ritual for me is get up, leave it, go for a run, go to the gym, have a protein shake, coffee, and then I'll normally go to a coffee shop, have my journal, go through my day plan, what projects I need to work on, brainstorm my ideas, and then, um, yeah, I'll probably start work at like 11, 12. And then it's probably sprint, so like a 90 minute sprint, rest, do some lunch, another 90 minutes, then maybe another 90 minutes. So like, I think the core focus time is important. So realistically, three lots of, yeah, three lots of chunks of 90 minutes. If I haven't got a mastermind Q&A or something on that day, is, is normally how I best work. But I, I like floating around and having freedom, I think just a lot now, like because one decision can make a big impact. So there might be two, three days where people might think I don't, actually do work as such, apart from maybe catching up with some, with some of the team in Slack. But a lot of the time I'm thinking about recreating my offer, what value I can bring, whether it's a new ad campaign, whatever, I'm just doing a lot of the thinking stuff because that's when the best ideas come, rather than tasks all of the time. I don't really like sticking to them anymore, but I had to do that to get to where I got to. So that's what a lot of people try and skip to the point of how can I uh, automate and delegate and systemize my business from day one and not be working in the business. Like I worked in the business for the th first like three years or so at least. And it did the extra 60, 70 hours a week while systemizing a business, whilst delegating, because that's what it takes to be successful. Thank you.